So, anti-piracy stuff really blew up at the start of this year, and although many of the anti-piracy screens that made their rounds on the internet were cool, pretty much all of them were fake. That said, many of them were actually based on real anti-piracy measures that were implemented in some games. And one of these games is The Legend of Zelda Spirit Tracks. Now normally, in the intro section to the game, you have to commandeer a train to get to the castle, and you're given a bunch of touchscreen controls to do so. However, if you were playing a copy of the game obtained by less than legal means, these controls would just be missing, and thus making it impossible to get any further into the game. And it looks like some people had to find out the hard way.